on into this. Hello, everybody. Yes, we are live, I think. Hello, everybody. My name is Tori. Um, welcome to Tori Tangents. I'm just going to keep with the Tori thing. Uh, hi, everybody. My name is Tori. Today, we are continuing our playthrough of... Gotta put the source up, otherwise you can't see it. Of... Um... <laughs> Resident Evil Village, which you see in the corner down here. Um, you might say, but sorry, claustrophobic, you're all, you're all surrounded by screens and mics and things and, 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 and screens and stuff like that. But uh, don't worry about it. It's, it's fine. It's okay. Um, we'll deal with it. We'll go in another view later and it'll be fine. Okay, this this one, you see, look, whoop. Okay, that one's already out of the way. Boom, there, extra space. Created, opened up. And you might be, sorry, where's your like luscious, why isn't your hair all loose and free and flowing? Why do you look like a bad impersonator of like fucking Jetstream Sam from Metal Gear Solid, Metal Gear Rising Revengeance? Why, why, why? <laughs> reason is simple. I'm putting my hair in a ponytail today because I'm expecting, and and when I put on the VR headset, and it's going to be like clamped behind my head, that, uh, thank you um, for the pin, by the way, Ophi, welcome in. Um, I'm going to be expecting that I'm going to be able to use the, the, the headset maybe a little bit longer than normal, maybe maybe not, it'll, it'll like clamp my head. So we're, we're testing that out to make sure and see if it, it'll, it'll work, yes or no. Um, you also might have noticed the lighting's a little bit different, as it is every day, because I always constantly keep on changing it, because I can't stay to consistent lighting. Um, you might also hear me later on having to get up, because my cat's in the room, and she's taking a nice little nap over there. Oh, adorable. Um, and, yeah, yeah, so, so, last time, we started our playthrough in the village, in VR. We explored many different areas, basically coming to the conclusion that, um, VR is really spooky, and my main complaint that this ga I had with this game back when it came out was just like, I didn't like the FOV, or the way it controlled. Um, this game fixes it. The, the VR mode fixes basically my one main gripe with the game. However, I have no idea how we're gonna fare, because we just did the like village intro sequence, right? We did like the bare minimum of content last time, but we are already very um, spooked, so uh, it'll be very interesting as we have to go do... If I remember correctly, which memory is my memory may not be perfect all the time, but I think the next area is Castle Dimitrescu, which... You know, means we're gonna be introduced to them heavies. The heavies! Dimitrescu! Don't worry, she's not after us. She's only after us to step on us. I mean, cloths. I mean, you know, that kind of stuff. The donuts are eternal. Donuts are eternal. Welcome in, Billy. Hell yeah. Um, so, so yeah, that's essentially what we're going to be doing today. You might also notice my fit is a lot like lighter. Again, I'm anticipating the sweaty gamer coming out. You know, the sweaty gamer, as this is essentially a workout at this point. So, um, yeah. Um, also, I, I totally forgot that apparently we had a block attack. So... We should try and see if that actually works, and perhaps even try and throw a punch, because I still believe I should be able to throw a punch on an enemy. I, I don't know why I feel like I feel like I should be able to do that, even though I'm not 100%. How's the word? Uh, confident that it's gonna work out. What is gonna be confident for me to work out is to dr is to drink F energy and caffeine and have that counterbalance any tiredness I might be feeling, any slight tiredness, because it's not like I'm mega tired or whatever. But I had a work day, you know, so that's some. Um, no, it was good actually at work. So yeah, that combined with with me, me uh, very, being very anticipatory of continuing my PSVR adventure means that we'll be continuing adventuring deep into the castle. Oh dang, there we go. Is the avatar broken? <laughs> I am the avatar. D there is no avatar. There is no. <laughs> there is no. Uh, what's the word? <laughs> God damn it! Wait, let me see. <laughs> there is no. Um, no Tory embossing. No, there is no VTuber embossing. Stay. So don't worry about it. Okay. Okay, it's cool. A ratchet joint. I'll be able to like turn up and down the like game music. That's actually pretty neat. Um, the avatar never existed. You imagine things. True. <laughs> It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. Don't worry about it. There's no Tori, only Zool. <laughs> Zool, motherfucker. Zool. Okay, wait, let me take off this band. Oh, my 
hair's all wet because I took a shower. Can I try to do the thing thing before streams where I like take a shower before, as I think that's like ah yes, the best course of action is to take a shower before you do the stream, right? So you're all like refreshed and good for stream. But then I remembered I don't have a good hair routine, and therefore my hair is all clogged and whatever. So you know, put in a ponytail in a bit. <laughs> my pelvis in the dishwasher. Oh no. <laughs> Ura. Yeah. Um, wait, let me let me say an update. There's some, something else that happened, by the way. Which I'm 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 gonna see if I can tangent for not too long before starting the game. However, at the time of this video release, I just watched yesterday Godzilla X Kong, a new empire. And I'm telling you, for a dude that has been following these monsterverse movies for a long time, they finally got it right. 30 minutes of uninterrupted Godzilla Kong backshot. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. Um, actual uninterrupted fight scenes that don't just constantly cut the humans to annoy the fucking ever-loving shit out of me. The only time you see humans is when they're running ah, away when they're being crushed by big monsters. It's perfect. Finally, a music that, a, a music that appeals to me. A movie that appeals to me. People dying everywhere and big monster going grrrr. All I needed. It's all I needed. Now I just need a good kaiju slash mech game to give me that same fantasy in VR. That's all I need. That's the one more thing I need in life. I'll be set. That's all I want. I wanted a good monster verse movie. Finally fucking got it. Had a fight scene sequence to rival Pacific Rim. Still not as good. Funnily enough, something about like the way Pacific Rim is directed. The first one, right? Like, like well, there's only one. Um, makes it so that that movie still hasn't been topped, in my opinion, fully. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, no, I got, I got a really good fucking monster movie, finally. It took them ten years to get me another, another fight scene as that gets close to the same fun I had as a, as in Pacific Rim. And next month I get a new Mad Max movie, so it's, it's great. The poorly written humans are kept to a minimal. Not only are the poorly kept humans kept to a minimum, the humans that they have, like, they figured out how to use the humans, right? This is how you use the humans in a Godzilla and Kong movie. You make them sort of background characters that are lightly assisting our main characters, and they need to know that they're silly. They introduce a new character into the movie. Steve, I think his name is. I don't remember. I think his name is Steve. And he's the best dude. He's like a dude. He wears a Hawaii shirt. He's just living life, man. And he helps out the monsters by making them gadgets and shit, and like being like a dentist for monsters. It's perfect. Fuck it. You get multiple scenes of Godzilla just absolutely ravaging things. Which is good. He, he's just an absolute asshole. He's like a big cat. Which is actually ironic because my cat's all curled up there. He just, he's like a big angry cat who's like territorial. He just goes attacking shit and then just takes naps in the Coliseum because he's like, you know what, fuck, anyway, might as well take a little nap. Um, which apparently they expanded upon a tiny bit in the novelization that he does it because it reminds him of his home. And that's so sad. Oh. No, it was a cute, it was a cute movie with a lot of humor. And a lot of child violence. <laughs> what point? Slight spoiler. The meme has been going around, right? You just have Kong using little, like a little baby Kong as a fucking weapon, just slamming a baby around against another baby. I have no idea how they got that approved, but it's fucking glorious. So if you want one movie recommendation, they just have fun with, right? Not for deeper meanings or oh, the mise en scène was talking about the existential existence of life. No. If you want a fun, good time, go watch Godzilla x Kong. No, sadly enough, they don't fuck. Or do they? No, they, no, they don't. They, they don't. Stupid ass. Uh, <laughs> it's better to watch it every three to four days. This is too much washing. Takes the body to produce too much oil. Oh, yeah, that's also true. I do tend to wash my hair a lot. That is true. Hmm. Favorite monster movie is Godzilla Final Wars. That one is, that one, that was like a long one. Ew, that's an old one. Dang. I, the one I actually recommend is Shin Ultraman. Shin Ultraman I still haven't seen, but I have. I need to get to that because I know it's also from Hideaki Anno and stuff like that, right? Which I'm a big fan of. Um, if if I if there's any of the old old Godzilla movies I'd recommend, it's the 2002 movie Godzilla against Mecha Godzilla. I think it's called. It it has a stupid title, but it's essentially Godzilla versus Mecha Godzilla. But it's like the 2002 movie. Um, it's really good. It has a sequel, which isn't as good. Funnily enough, but like that movie on its own, really, really solid, really solid. Um, I have like a copy. 
of it that's like a 1080p like master which is a really it's a really good one it's a really good one actually um a lot of grain a lot of granular quality you get to really see like little miniatures and stuff, and they sell it in a very nice way is some of the cgi dated in that movie of course it is and it looks like ass but you know it's kept to a very 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 high minimum so all you really care about is the scene where mecha godzilla punches godzilla where there's two suits just going against each other you know i describe it like a fucking toy but that's that's Okay, it's kind of the point, but still, you know, the movie's great. Movie's good, and I had a lot of fun with it. Um, the best trilogy of kaiju movies was the '90s Gamera series. Keep hearing about that, but still haven't seen it. They <laughs> don't fuck. Not worth it. Don't 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 worry about it. You don't get Godzilla fucking Kong, but you do get Kong using a baby Kong as a weapon against other adults. Which is the only movie in cinema you'll see where a dude uses a baby as a weapon. Which is what I wanted to do in Resident Evil Village to defend myself against Mia. But the game wouldn't allow me. Zero out of ten. How dare they. <laughs> At least the internet has Sonic X Shadow Generations to look forward to. Shadow, what the fucker? No, Shadow, get out of my ass! Ow, Shadow, what the fuck? Silence, Sonic. I have to backshot you because that's the title's name. <laughs> I miss my wife, Tails. <laughs> oh, I have problems. Oh, well. Um, I have no idea what the fuck to talk about anymore. That just totally... Uh, yeah, that's that's the final mental image I needed. Sonic the Hedgehog fucking... Son, uh, Shadow the Hedgehog fucking Sonic up the ass. Yes, that is definitely what everyone needed. Now I'm getting a headache because of that. Ah! Yes, perfect. Game of time. No game of time until I finish my drink. It was always Sonic. Well, be happy it's Sonic and not... You know who. He always comes back. <laughs> I always... No, that's not the voice. I always come back. <laughs> no! How dare you? Look! Oh, wait a minute. Look, Twitch chat works again. Hey! It functions. Let's go. Look at that. We've got, chi Twitch. We've got Twitch chat. Twitch chat. We got Twitch chat back. Twitch is out of jail. Yeah, apparently it works again. That's pretty nice. Favorite kaiju is King Kaiser, but no, there's no way to have him in the modern CGI movies or as being a cat bear with kung fu moves will be as silly as Gigan or Frankenstein. Well, if they can do Scar King and Shimo, I actually don't see a reason why they couldn't bring back movie uh, things like King Caesar, except if it's like a rights issue with Toho. That's the one reason I could see them not doing it. Like, at this point in the MonsterVerse movie, after this one, I could totally accept them doing J Jaguar. In a sort of, like, you know, modernized, cool-looking way, but, like, they'd totally do Jet Jaguar in the next one. If they, if, they, if they have some balls, do that. Have Monarch make their own Jet Jaguar. Do it. <laughs> titty chat. What titty chat? Released. No. <laughs> Not titty chat. No. Twitch is going to bonk my ass. If I don't watch out. Sound like you said titty instead of Twitch. I say a lot of things. Don't hold them against me. Um... But yeah, no. So 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 we I saw Godzilla X Kong. It was it has it's way better than it has any right to be. No, I haven't seen Godzilla minus one. It's probably a serious good movie like Shit Godzilla. But I mean, I wanted a good stupid one, and I got the best stupid one. One that didn't cut away. One that didn't edge me with its fight scenes. One that didn't like do the fucking thinking the monsters kept doing, where it's like, oh, they're finally fighting, and then we're gonna cut to the humans or whatever, you know? Or we're gonna have the humans obstruct the vision of the fight. Or some crap like that, right? Or what even Godzilla uh, versus Kong had, where sometimes they'd like, oh, they're fighting, and then we're gonna cut to the humans doing something else because they're gonna stop Mecha Godzilla. It's like, no! Just let them fucking fight, you idiots! And they did that. 
And they sound way too excited about that. And but okay, outside of them, the, outside of the fight scene being really good, right? The like build up, the character acting with Kong and like the Scar King and stuff like that is really fun. Um, you'd be amazed how much like non-verbal communication you can get between two big CGI monkeys just making growling noises at each other for like ten minutes, right? That scene has more like body acting in it. And for a simple plot, but like for, for like body wise, the acting they portray there is actually really good. Um, you know, like like it's 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 really good. It's funny the original Godzilla versus King Kong was originally going to be Frankenstein instead of Kong. Yeah, and then they had to change it, or they changed it because it wasn't like that popular or whatever. But you know, still it's cool. As far as, as monster movies go, I'd silly say is Meg or Q the Winged Serpent. Ugh. Well, Godzilla does fight a serpent. Kong also fights a serpent, come to think of it in the movie. Huh. The MonsterVerse really likes serpents for some reason. Or well, actually, it doesn't, because it kills them all, but whatever. Um, they also really slim down Godzilla for some reason. He gets, like, very... It's like he's fat in the beginning, and they just, like, take the whole bulge... His, like, brrr, bulge, bulge build away from him. Which I'm kind of double on. I kind of get it, because, okay, the big complaint for the for American Godzilla is that he's, you know, very American. You know, he's a big boy. I actually kind of like that. You know, Godzilla's like, is like a crazy angry uncle. <laughs> and everyone who comes on his territory just gets a fucking beating. And also, if he just feels like it, you get a beating. <laughs> That's Godzilla. The only thing keeping him calm is like his wife, Mothra, who has gone for, for, has been gone for a few movies. But, um, you know, Finally get some happy times. Let's go. Where, where was I going with this? Mm. America, yeah. Uh. So, there we go. 16 minutes of not playing this game. And instead, this game. It's here. I forgot to forget. It's here. Of not playing this game and just talking about anything but fucking resident evil um as we finish our drink have our energy and our caffeine and can go into the game and cause lots of devastation yeah 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 game time let me first prepare by grabbing all the hair on my head to make a high end not a high end to make a high Top ponytail, so I could use that to make it so I don't keep catching the device, so the device can be mounted clearly on the top of my head. I have to make like a like one of those orc ponytails, you know, like the orcs from Warhammer. They have like the ponytail at the top. I just still not like that design for for them for a long time, by the way. So much so that one of the reasons I never played Orcs from Warhammer was just because I didn't like their top-up ponytails, you know? I liked their cartoony design and stuff like that, uh, but I never liked that that much. Also, didn't really, funnily enough, I didn't really like the green on the green skins, even though I'm, I really like the color green, but somehow green on the green skins never really clicked with me for some reason. Don't know why. Okay, so look, now we got the... Now we got the top... Not look thing... Yeah, there, it's, it's in the back of my head. <sighs> we can get started by playing Resident Evil Village. My hot take, Resident Evil isn't very good. I prefer Days Gone and Dying Light. Nah, bad take. I think Resident Evil did the zombie part way better when it comes to, like, painting a world. I think Dying Light and Days Gone function as games... But Dying Light is too massive for its own good, making individual zombie encounters very menial. And I haven't played Days Gone, so I can't talk about that. But Dying Light, I played ages ago, and it was... In but this is my problem. It was incredibly boring. I played it for a few hours, got good at the, like, loop, which is, like, push away, gunfight, whatever, and then I got bored of it. Which is my, which is my take. Okay, my take. Maybe you had more fun with it, but I didn't like that, that Dying Light is one of those zombie games that makes zombies too trivial. Whereas in Resident Evil, what I immediately noticed with the 2 remake was that they made zombies more punchy. They're still kind of pushovers, but they're, you know, more punchy. 
but you know um and then what i like about resident evil is that at least they always are constantly doing different things it's not just zombies it's, it's werewolves it's it's hillbillies <laughs> It's hillbillies. It's it's you know crazy families and incest plots and incest families and and, 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 and corporations. Ooh, you know, it's a lot of shit in there. It's good. Dead Rising over Dying Light. Isn't Dead Rising the the no? That's Dead Island. So many dead. Just it's a lot of dead dying or de or or duped. YouTube brought up Dead Rising, <laughs> but I don't know Dead Rising. Again, I, I for a lot of the 2010s zomber, zombie craze era, I kind of got bored with them all because a lot of them, again, tend to trivialize the zombie a bit too much, you know. And it's fun in Left 4 Dead, but then every other game had to make them as trivial as Left 4 Dead. A game I kind of appreciated but never finished because I got, again, I didn't play it enough because I got bored with it, was, uh, or no, because I didn't have the Wii U at my place, was Zombie U on the Wii U. That, like, sur survival England, they, they, I think they made a port, they called it Zombie, they took the U out for, for PC, but that was a fun one, actually, because you had, like, an interactive thing with the pad, it was kind of, it was kind of cool, um, it was, like, you had to hit things, it was very slow-paced, very methodical, it was kind of nice, actually, but I never finished it, and the zombies were very punishing, like, zombies could totally kill, regular zombies could totally kill your ass, um, although then they introduced, like, energy zombies, and it becomes stupid again, and then I didn't like it, um, whatever, okay, so let's get started by settling in. Let me quickly change the the um, the category. There's an evil village. There we go. Change the category. Now, disclaimer. I don't know if it's in the disclaimer, but uh, more than likely, I will not be able to read all of chat constantly. However, what I'll do is periodically I'll like, you know, take little breaks, take off the headset and come look at chat. The reason for that being, well, I can't look at chat whilst having the game in being in game mode because I because unlike PC VR, I can't kind of mount you in my world or whatever. That's the one sort of downside of playing on the PS5. The, the advantage is that you get a somewhat better view. Yeah. I tried upping the um the resolution on Twitch to 1080p this time, so this time you have a little bit more quality, which might make it better for when I make TikTok shorts out of it, but whatever. Um, the one thing I did notice, ho though, however, and it kind of made me reflect on it a little bit in this game, with the Louisa house section is... And it, it, it is kind of distracting because I keep thinking about it. <laughs> in Resident Evil Village, when you meet the people at the Louisa's house, they talk like perfect, essentially, American English, right? Which is just very weird, because in Europe, nobody speaks perfect American English. Nobody speaks perfect English, for that matter. It all sounds kind of broken in one way or another, you know? Like, it's always, it's all, you, you might think, oh, it's stereotypical to try and put, like, a heavy accent in there. But it's like, no, no, that's, like, real. <laughs> like, the sort of broken English, sort of Slavic sounding, almost, see, that, that's European English. That's, if you want real European English... Look at ministers on the TV. Even they can't fucking pronounce the language right, right? So it's kind of funny to have this game have them all speak just like English, English. And it's very... It's kind of distracting. Like, eventually Dimitrescu speaking English, that doesn't surprise me because it's like an aristocratic royal or whatever, sure. But, like, just the villagers, for them to be talking essentially perfect English in this, like, European settling, it's just kind of... It's kind of weird, if that makes sense. But is it lame that they're so not good enough? <laughs> the game with bigger boobs and undead creatures, Conan Exiles. What? No. <laughs> uh, it's about power, not sex. Don't worry about you perverts. Think of uh, sex, not about sex, but power. But power. Okay, so I'm going to move to the back here. You might be saying, but sorry! How will we see you? You're all blurry and shit. Well, I'm going to press this button. Shit. Okay, the button didn't work. Uh... Okay, wait a minute. I have to change a thing. I'm going to just turn up the f-stops 
making everything blurrier, uh, making everything sharper, and then I'll bump up the ISO, because that is a thing I can do. And I'll just turn on this light, which is conveniently thrown here to the side. I'm going to... Ah! Fucking God damn it! I'm put that there. It's going to blind me from my side. Ugh. It's actually very light. Holy shit. Um, let me bring down the sight. There we go. Because that will allow me to turn up the ISO a bit more, which will then allow me to reset... The thing. Am I sharp from here? Dang it. Area 4 or 5 of the affected citizens speak their native language. Well. Again, English is fine. Just broken English or whatever, you know? <sighs> we could all see his black hair in 4K. It's not black. It's dark brown, by the way. It only looks kind of black because it's like wet and shit. But you can see in like when it's highlighted by light and shit that it's not black hair. Black hair is different, right? Like, like can't really def decently, I can kind of decently show it. You can kind of see it in the highlight on the hair here that it's like a, a tint of brown. It's dark brown hair, but it's actually not black. Uh, black hair looks different. Anyway, uh, with that little thing out of the way, let me strap in into the horror. Let's go. It's horror time. Okay, so for that, first I'm going to turn up the game so you guys can hear that all the way as much as possible. Um, and at the moment when I'm strapped in, you know what? I'm going to change it to the gaming screen already so you see there you go so you guys are there and I am here and the controllers are here which are now I'm gonna first turn put on the controllers dope put those on first Beep. Actually, they're very convenient to turn put on by the way I really like it I'm gonna take the headset Ooh. I'm gonna take that and pull it to the back. Open it up. Scoop in with my ponytail. Adjust the thing here in the back. That's what I couldn't do last time. Yeah, this is way better. Holy shit. Uh, and then clamp it a little bit down so I can play the game. And from now on, I'm not going to be able to see you guys. I'm very sorry. Welcome to Resident Village. E to Village Resident Evil. Or Resident Evil 8, or Resident Evil 8 Village, or... <sighs> Make it more complicated, will you? Okay. Wait, I have to double check one thing. In my settings, has it... Oh, auto copy yeah. is off. Oh, so I was doing it right. Oh, okay, and I adjusted that. Because I was looking at what my dominant eye was, and apparently it's not my right eye. It's more my left eye. That's the more dominant one, so. Okay. Okay, I have my surroundings. And I am here. Oh, there's fog everywhere. Oh. Perfect aim, baby. Boom, baby! Let's go! Ha! Ha! Today... Today, we beat her. <laughs> Bro, this game looks good. I haven't adjusted any settings from last time, so normally you guys should be able to follow along perfectly fine. Hey! Well, that didn't do anything. Quickly see. There's a border around the screen. Oh, yeah, there is. What the fuck? Why? Uh. Oh, shit. Uh, let's see, go my other settings, perhaps it's a enable eye tracking, yes. Why is there a border around the screen? That's, that's new. Okay.
Tracking support. Turn this on to see if experience thingies are on or no. Okay, turn that off. Okay. Did this make it better? Aha! I think I fixed it. Yes, the PlayStation border. Fixed. Hell yeah. Something is messed up with the view. I, I can kind of, if I pull the headset back and like look at the screen, I can move one eye keenly see you guys on the side. There we go. Ha! I wonder if it adjusted my... Eh, nah, my, my aim is just as good as before. Hello? Hearing something. Okay. Do, 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 do. So I have the two things for that door with the little hands and shit. So now, let me quickly e go down the village one more time. Let's see this thing. Oh, if I could just drop stuff at it, like... So we got a boomstick. Oh, wait a minute. Okay. Okay, let's go. So for you, put the no, put the no, put the no, no, the eh, eh. Oh yeah, put the eh. Well, that's wrong. There we go. No, no. Yeah, there we go. And for you, I need the. That there. And turn and align with the lady. There we go. Ooh. Nothing but blood and death. Huh? The architecture in the game. Ethan has dirty hands. Yeah, he's stinky hands. Oh, look at like the. Like, I like, okay, this is a little too flat for my taste, but like, the little hands and shit, the little, little decimated hand detail here on the wall and stuff like that, you know, just all that. The fire there, the fire effect looks pretty good as well. Well, if no one else is gonna go there, I might as well go myself. Okay. Hello. Ooh, it's kind of cool. You can kind of see up to there. It's real, and then from there on, it's like a like a small. It's like a miniature set. It kind of looks like if you've ever been to Universal Studios and you've like been to the Harry Potter experience. You know, it's like Hogwarts where they have like a part of it really built, and then a other parts like a miniature set. Kind of looks like that. That's actually kind of cool. What the fuck? Yeah, this place is like a theme park ride. Whoa. That's freaky. Oh. Well, hello there. It's a yellow cable. That's a weird one. I'm gonna worry too much about it. Hello, it's me! I am Ethan. I am the man thing. Here for... Booby Adventures.
No! Floating there, that's a weird. Okay. Hello. Hello. This is a uh, not a happy place at all. It's all dirty and stinky and wet. That's yellow, that's advancements. What are you? No. What are you? It's locked from the other side. Okay. That's good to know. Well. Hello! Ah! Where did you come from? Didn't think anyone was left. You must be. Pretty tough. Tough. Oh. Who the fuck are you? Oh, you're not local. Even better. Ah. Oh, shit! Ah. Mother Miranda's gonna love you. <laughs> hey! the fun in that. Give them to me, and I'll put on a show that everybody can enjoy. Oh, so gauche. What do we care for bread and circuses? The man thing's suffering is assured. Yeah, gags. The man's dick is cut off in the castle. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I've heard all your arguments. Some of you were less persuasive than others, but I've made my decision. Heisenberg. The man's fate is in your hands. Mother Miranda, I must protest. Heisenberg is but a child, and his devotion to you is questionable. Give the mortal to me, and I will ensure he is ready. Shut your damn up! And don't be a sore loser! You'll find your food somewhere else. Quiet now, child. Adults are talking. I'm the child. You're the one who's arguing with Miranda's decision. You wouldn't know responsibility if it was well. Oh, to keep glory! One day your head might actually fit your ego. Fight! 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 Hey, don't fight, I get a fight, say in this? <laughs> Silence! My decision is final. Right. Remember from whence you came. Thank you. Huh. Lycans oh, hey. and gentlemen, we thank you for your And now let the games begin. Let's see what you can do. Ethan Winters. Get ready. No way! Let's go! Three, two, Can't jump. One, jump. Ow! Ow! Oh, we go! We go! Yeah! We running! Ah, Jesus Christ! Let's go! Ah. <laughs> Run to your life! 
Freaks have rows. Oh my god, Ethan. Take that. Well. Let's see, it's a visual. It's a big boy. Bro, this cave is huge. I feel a little less contrasty than I think. Wait a minute. Can I adjust that? There we go. <laughs> Not all just that the next time I have a save room. Okay. Hello. Got my knife back. So fuck you, God. There you go. The fuck is that? Well, that looks like a death. Looks like a death trap. You look like a. It's not like a happy place. Why are they all sleeping so nicely? Oh, look at the rocks. That's actually a nice, like, caveman in the walls. That's actually kind of neat. Here again. You are a door. I don't need you. I just need to go here. I exit the castle like this. find out what's in there. It's called death, destruction, and more pain. Okay, there we go. Can I do it this time without getting killed by a fucking asshole? Good. Did 
Hello. How are you doing? It is just me. I am Ethan. Winters. Hello. I just want a safe station that does not look like a happy dude. Aha! Wait a minute, it's crows. You know what time it is. Snake! Ah! Yeah! Woo! First try, bitch! Oh, those are dudes. That's not good. Uh, he looks pretty dead. Whoa, the castle is huge. Hmm. Well, I'm just gonna keep crawling on the floor. That is where I want to be. Da -da -da -da. Oh. Uh, I've been waiting for you, Mr. Winters. How do you know my name? Anyone who is anyone has heard of the likes of you. He's a hero He's searching for his daughter. Though I must say, that castle arouses suspicion. I know, right? Yeah, and so do you. <laughs> I am but a humble merchant. Here? Oh, forgive my manners. Call me the Duke. Now to business. Weapons, ammunition, healing salves, anything you desire, I can provide. Now this I can get along with. Okay, by the way, I haven't asked. Uh, how is, is the audio good? Oh, hey! Audio check! Is it fine? Is it, like, decent enough to follow along with? Audio good? Okay. For some reason, I find that my microphone is more silent than last time. I'm not, but I'm not certain. Is, or is that just me? Hmm. 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 Well, it is a little more quiet, right? But I can't figure out what the fuck it is that's causing it to be more quiet. Wait a minute. Actually, I have a perfect idea of what it could be. Let's see. Let's see, does that change just a tiny bit? Does that make it a little bit louder, maybe? No idea. Maybe a tiny bit. Ah, here's what it is. Wait, let me, let me come back to the, to the... Ooh. Wait a minute, quickly. Quickly, ooh, change you guys there. I'm gonna... Mm, let me quickly go back to previous screen. Quickly take my headset off just a tiny bit. I'm gonna very subtly, ever so subtly, turn up the gain just a tiny bit. It's not gonna peak because I'm far away anyway, so I'm just gonna set it to that. There we go. Put it there. For when I'm far away. Oops. He's huge. I was gonna say it as well. Dimitrescu weirdly has like a big head. It's much more noticeable. Welcome, now. Ethan. Oh. Ooh. Please let me know if you'd like to strengthen your weapons. That's 2,000 lay. God damn it, that's a lot of expensive. First aid hair trigger. Uh huh. The handgun. Increases ammo capacity. Cool. Shoddy shells. Melee. No, we'll use knife of a large blade. Come now. I'm a merchant after all. Ah, that's in case you didn't get the shotgun in the city. You can get it here. Actually, this is kind of cool. Okay, so none of this is useful. 
learn how to do shotgun ammo using the crafting menu. That's sorry, it. but I do not give discounts. Fine. Uh oh, gunsmithy. Power. Bro, everything's fucking expensive. Maybe I just well, I didn't kill that many. Maybe that's a me mistake. Maybe I should have killed more in that in the area leading up to here. Ooh, wait a minute. Yeah, well, two of those sell all treasure. <laughs> to think I would buy such things. I don't know. You're the one buying shit. Okay, so if that's true, then you can give me this too, right? Which would be pretty useful. Uh -huh. And then in the gunsmithy, I can go see 3,000 extra ammo. Uh, ammo capacity. Ooh, almost. Ammo capacity for this one. Almost. Shit. Interesting. You know what? I'll accept that. You heard that? I did good, I think. Wait, I can just quickly easily. Better, but more echoey? Hmm. Well, it is what it is. At least you can now hear me a bit better. So that's nice. <sighs> Please come again. Do you have a save station, maybe? Of course not. It'd be be asking way too much. Wait, let me quickly put the little lid back on the the vocube. cube. I'm doing this blind, by the way. This is some great remembrance skill. God damn it. There we go. Let me quickly double check something. Okay, my cat's still sleeping. Good. Okay, you stay there, big guy, and I'm gonna go explore there. Let me also quickly double check crafting. Ooh, nice. Can you tell I don't trust this place? Oh well. Hello. It's me. I'm Tori. I'm here for. I'm here for the big titty convention. The big titty squeezing convention. I need to inspect them. Ah. Okay. Jesus Christ. Oh. Well, that's not good. Hello? Could Rose be here? I don't know, but probably not, but probably maybe. Aha! Uh -huh. Three daughters, Bella, Cassandra, and Daniela. Well, I've seen Van Helsing. That's mine. Enter a house, destroy things. Enter a house, destroy things immediately. Immediately buy stuff as well. Nothing happens. Okay. Sure. Fine. I can deal with it. Hello, it's me. Okay. I like the like the fabric of these, the design of these is actually really cool. 
really... Also, this place is, like, kind of cramped. It's a little claustrophobic, which is actually funny because it's a big royal house. Although, in VR, it makes more sense, I suppose. Hello? Sneaking around the mansion, Colonel. Colonel, I'm sneaking around. The clap of my ass cheeks keeps alerting the vampires, bro. <laughs> I hate that noise. I hate that noise. I hate that noise. Save point. Let's go! Okay, because I quickly need to do... Thing, what the fuck? Ooh. That's cool. Looks like there's a hole for something spherical. Ah, okay. Holes. The North... Northeen's Labyrinth. A craftsman of late 19th century Northeen was branded a heretic in his homeland. He wandered the lands until he settled in a remote village. Northstein then created four labyrinth, labyrinths. The castle, the house on the hill, the water wheel, and the iron tower. Upon their completion, he put a gun to his temple, took his own life. Well, that sucks. Each labyrinth is unique and requires its own specially crafted metal ball to operate. Each one contains crystallized human remains, which are said to be Northstein's four beloved wives. Labyrinth are their graves. Oh! That sucks. Okay. Um. Hello? Okay, let me quickly. Now that I have the ability to. Quit the game, go back to the settings menu, and adjust the OLED quickly if I can. the save room music it's kind of calming okay back to the horrors of this fucking place i think i saw lore back in the earlier rooms so i'm gonna go back there quickly yes i knew i saw lore january 5th rednick delivery of one male three females Ugh. January 28th, Mother Miranda, meeting with Dimitrescu. January 1st, the Duke, business discussions. Huh, so the Duke is a familiar to the people here. Curious. No. Not that door! That door! That's the door we're going. Masked angels blinded gaze and only- uh oh. Looking for Rose? 
over everything, don't I? Ah, shit. <laughs> Not my kneecaps. Man blood. Titties! No! <laughs> Not what I wanted! Ah, that's my second leg, you bitch! <laughs> this is why we can't trust women in Resident Evil! Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, look, it's like little hooks. Uh -oh. oh. Mother? I bring you fresh prey. You are so kind to me, daughters. Mm -hmm. Oh, damn, it's the snoo snoo bed. Oh, no. <sighs> now, let's take a look at him. Well, well, Ethan Winters. You escaped my little brother's idiot games, did you? Let's see how special you are. Yes, mother. Yes, mother. Hey! <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Ah! Oh! <laughs> Bro! Hey, yo! Hmm. Ugh. Starting to go a little stiff. Then let's devour his man flesh quickly, Mother. But I am the one who captured him. Now, now, daughters. First, I must inform Mother Miranda. But later, well, there will be enough for everyone. Yeah, I got enough for everyone. <laughs> <laughs> That was a dick joke. That was a dick joke. Oh, I, God damn it! <laughs> oh. Oh, be careful what you wish for, Ethan Winters. <laughs> Can you guys stop laughing at me? Oh, there she goes. Wait, wait, wait. Whoa, 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 buddy. What are you doing? <laughs> There's blood everywhere. Fuck! Dang it! Well. How's it hanging? Can I... Can I just... Come on! Yeah! <laughs> Come on! Well, there's not much hand there anyway. Ow! Oh. <laughs> no, a bunch of crazy bitches, Ethan. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Put that in there. Uh, more fucking shit on my hands. Great. Lovely. No. Oh, disgusting. Look at that. Ew. Well. I need to chain my legs up, I suppose. It's a horse thing. Oh! I swear to God, I get nothing in this world. That view, though. <laughs> True, right? The sky is the limit. Oh. Give me that. Eh. I can't grab it. Sadness. Her ass was in that. That's the snoo snoo bed. Look at that. You know, for a woman that's that big, this bed is kind of small. Or she just kind of lay over her legs out. Hmm. Many questions we might have, we'll never get the answer to. <laughs> okay, let's explore the rest of this room. Nothing else supply-wise. Okay, then I guess we just... Leave. I have one thing I want to quickly double check.
Damn it. Easy to lockpick. My ass is easy to lockpick. I don't get shit. Interesting. Can't grab anything here. Oh, there's like a glove there, like a veil. Interesting. Ah, and they were having some kind of tea party. There's probably blood in there. Okay, I can't grab it, sadness. Can I escape through here? It's locked from the other side. Probably a good idea, but oh well, okay. Well, if there's nothing else here, well, this place is pretty. I kind of ran through it the first time, but you really get to like, that's the thing about VR, you do kind of get a really, get an appreciation for every room when it's like filled with details and shit. Maidens of the Harvest, aha. Uh -huh. Something, something, my dick! No, um. The joke, yes, penis. Anyway, um. Let's crawl through the hole. Oh! I'm really on the floor. Truly on all fours. Oh, look, a rat! Oh, it's a rat! Rat, rat. Where the rats? That I like. Thank you, Ethan. Hmm. Aha. Uh -huh. So the baby bees is okay, wait, give me one second. I was just noticing what's so weird about today. My screen is a little bit foggy on one of the screens, so let me carefully grab a microfiber cloth or get heated out of the play area. That makes sense. Let me quickly just make little circles with my finger on the screens so that they're just... There we go. Hey, hey. Yep, yep. Ah! Oh, the noise there scared me. Mow. Okay. Looks like you could smell them. <laughs> Decrepit. Hundred years decay. The breath is emergency food. True. True emergency food. Let's go. All right. The, look at that. Look at that. You can, you can almost like taste the mold. I mean, like, touch the mold. Shiny. Ah! But I don't want to go to the castle. Did it. Okay, now I have a loop. Ah, yes, the biggest question on our minds right now, right? Where is Rose? The angel of... was it anger? Looks down from a range up high. The angel of... visage... something. 
Oh, I have to look at that. Okay, I can't look at her titties to have the, the text show up. Sadness. I'm Tori, cultured anime watcher of the titties. Yes. Very much my MO. Okay. Oh. oh, we meet again. Duke, why are you here? Where there's coin to be made. <clears throat> and have you found your daughter? No. If she is truly here, the lady of the castle would have kept little Rose in her private chambers. Would she not? Dami Tresk? The very Dami same. Dami Tresk? Dami why don't you take a look? Maybe you'll get lucky. Speaking of looking, care to make a purchase? Well, if I have money. Seeking something in particular? Well, I don't know. I'm skilled at all sorts of weapons modifications, and will do them for a small fee. Uh huh. Well, what do I want, though? That's the thing. And that costs too much, so here I have nothing I can really do. But here... Leave this to me. That might be a good idea. Yeah. Thank you for your patronage! Bro, only here can you truly appreciate how fucking massive my man's is. Look at him! Look at him! He's huge! He's like... His head's like this big. Like, if it would be in front of me, it would be like, this big! Bro, he's huge! Look at him! He's a giant dude! Oh. Well, I'm gonna save again, unless there's something here I can get. <sighs> you must say, but Tori, you didn't experience anything yet! Why are you saving again? Well, because it's a spooky castle. So we can't exit through there because we need to do the puzzle. So we have to go up there. Oh, wow. Look at that chandelier. I don't know if it's properly conveyed how pretty it looks in VR, but like in flat, but holy shit. Yo. That fucking goat again. Shit, I can't throw it up there. You wait. You wait, you little shit. so much that noise you motherfucker I can see you dang it can't throw that high whoa look at that whoa yo look the couches look it's a cozy little place look I'm all cozy and shit king of the castle king of the castle Boom, baby. There we go. <sighs> okay, can't go there, can't go there. I feel very exposed right now, by the way, in the whole, you know, me. 
running around here. It's very exposing. I don't like it. Okay, it's doable. Mm. Boom, baby! Hello. How are you doing? It is me. I'm Tori. Well, look how the carpet is like all folded and shit. That's kind of cool. Oh. Making sure I have enough clearance here when it comes to my table. Okay. Oh, come on, it totally. Love throwing knives. How big is my inventory? Oh, okay. The inventory is incredibly forgiving when it comes to, like... There's a lot of darkness around me, but okay. The winemaking techniques of Castle Dimitras can be traced far as far back as the 15th century, long before the current occupant of the castle. Alicia Dimitras uses, uses this legendary yet peculiar technique to enrich the wine's flavors and intensity and bestow it with a thick bouquet. Her best vintage is Sangue Virginis, meaning the maiden, maiden's blood. It is kept in a special ornate bottle decorated with intricate silver flowers. Well, that's good, right? Well, it's not there at the moment, but I guess we'll have to go find it. Whew, wine time. No wine time, okay. Sadness. Oh, let me double check what the cat's doing. Oh, she's licking herself. Good for her. Okay, so we need to go get the wine bottle. Step one, find the wine bottle. Let's throw it in. Do, 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 do. Wait a minute. Didn't I pick up a... Where is it? New key eye. Aha! No, not you. Well. Ooh. There's like a roughness on it. That's cool. Seem to turn it around, that would have been nice, but oh well. You screaming thing probably want the eyeball. I can see that. This is horrifying. I hate that. Got him. I first, however, must collect everything I can loot goblin in my sight before doing anything bro this place actually kind of feels like an old one of those old-timey castle places i hate it i 
hate it. I hate this place. I hate this place. I hate it so fucking much. Locked from the other side, because of course it is. Because everything is! Okay. Gunpowder. Hey! Assholes! Oh, look at like the like the ooh. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's neat. That's neat. That's very neat. Okay, you. Oh. Ah! Fuck you, God damn it. Ha! Ah! Shit, 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 shit. Slice your jugular and just watch. Take a ah! dead witch would you prefer? I don't know! Run, 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 run. Get! Run! Ah! I panicked. I kinda ran. I panicked. Okay. Okay, sometimes the scares don't work 100% because, like, the bug crawling in of you, you don't really see it if you don't catch it immediately, which is kind of sad. On the other hand, it would be more distracting if they kept yeah. doing other things. Ooh. June 9th, 1958. Jesus Christ, that's long ago. Ah! Well, I hate that. That's spookier, dark ass hallway. It was my first day working at the castle today. It was my first day working at the castle today. Okay, yes, that's a... Whatever. I was more shocked to see the other staff were all women. The mistress and her daughters were very adamant that they went by. It was quite peculiar. June. June 23rd, 1958. It's been two weeks since I started working at the castle. And I am a little... Afraid. Another maid... Adela made a mistake, and Miss Daniela slashed her face with a knife. And at night, I can hear wailing, as if ghosts roamed the halls. I want to go home. But I am home! Well, not this one. The, the one I'm in in real life. July 8th. I don't know what to do. The young ladies were complaining it was too hot and stuffy during dinner, so I, I opened the window just to crack. SHUT IT! SHUT IT NOW! They all shrieked to me in uni unison. I fear I have been taken down. I may I may be taken down into the cellar. Never to be seen of again. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Rotting fruit. Okay. Can't grab it. Sadness. Okay, so find a window, open window, KILL THE FUCKING BUG BITCH! Got it. Hello? Let's go back on all fours. That's the bottle I need. Huh. Let's 
Let's go. I have been picking up so much handgun ammo. <laughs> <laughs> like I almost have two full fucking piles. Hell yeah, I'm gonna use it all in a bit probably by fucking being a dickhead. Oh. Are these tiny dead birds? Oh my god, can I... Can't, no, can't grab it. Sadness. Look at the tiny dead birds. Look at them. Look at the tiny dead birds. They're so tiny and dead. What, did she put dead birds in the fucking wine? I thought she put people in the wine. Oh god! Note to self, it's not that thing. Oh, it is people. It's people in the wine. There's people in the wine! There's people in the wine! Oh no! There's people in the wine! Hey, wait a minute. Haha! -ha! I see all little, little, little crystally thingies. All little crystally thingies are mine! I got a map in my butt. Okay. Who wants to go? Ooh. Oh, what the fuck? Hello? That's pretty cool. Grab that. God. Whoa. Yo, this room's awesome. Trust in light. Well. Well, that looks like a decal on like right in front of the wall texture, but okay. Like it's not on the wall. It's like a thing on a transparent glass in front of the wall. That's interesting. Whoa. <laughs> His face is all flat. Hmm. Honestly, even in first person, this part was kind of clunky. What is it like? Like, eh. I need you to lower. Looks like that'll swing with some force. Yeah, but. Eh. Okay. Like a cat. There we go. Oh! Okay, so just like a cat, I have to like. Eh. Eh. <sighs> Never seen a pit you don't want to go in? Well, that's it. Hello?
Flashlight! <laughs> no, 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 no! No, no, no! My body says no. My body says no. Okay. okay. I hate this so fucking much. I hate this a lot. I fucking hate this. Hey! It's covered in dry blood. Well, if it's dried blood, then. Let's drop the gun before I hastily shoot at things that I don't want to shoot at yet. Oh, oh yes, that's all lovely. Man catchers, I love it. Hello. I hate it. Thanks, I hate it. I absolutely hate it. Ah! Whoa, 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 fuck, what the fuck? Cat! Oh, oh my god, my cat. Fucking. Oh god, okay. <laughs> so my little asshole of cat just walked in front of me, but my foot is on the floor, right? Because I'm trying to ground myself. So my, my cat running around in front of me, I all of a sudden feel this little, like, triple, triple, tripling movements. Like, oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, wait, that. <laughs> Mm, okay, that got me. Shit, that was that was yeah. the scariest part of the game so far. My fucking cat. <laughs> oh, thanks for the follow. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that got me. Shit, what the fuck? Oh, that's um immersion. Yeah, my little cat. Boss, fight with your cat. I'm gonna throw her around. Welcome in, um, by the way. Welcome in. I can now read you. I can now read chat for a bit. You guys are also back on the screen, so so, so Twitch chat is back. Okay, where, wait, where's that cat? Where are you? Come here. No, come here. Ray, come here. Come here, you little shit. No. You scared the shit out of me. Have a good sleepies? Yeah, I'm gonna go sleepies. Look at her. Look at us. Look at this little shit. Look at how she scared me. Hmm. Come here. Come here. No, you don't. What? what do you mean? That's a that's a ear, that's a hair piece. Stop looking at the hair piece. Hmm. Look at her. Look at her. Look. Who needs who needs dark spooky ass dungeon when you can have. No, look. Spooky ass dungeon. No, look at that. Why are you spooky ass? When you can have, when you have kitty. Yes. Right. Why are you? Why do you look so disgusted with any everything? Why are you being all? Wait. Let's see if we can get it. You kind of hear her purring, just a little bit. Yeah, she knows what you did. She knows everything I do when I'm in the room. Look at her. No praying, she's so quiet. No, she's praying. Oh. Oh. Do we right to the mic? No, don't get. No, 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 no. You're trying to get on the table. Okay. I'm gonna quickly. Bring her to 
the front so she can eat and give her a little bit of food. And you guys will behave and be good little chats. Just entertain each other. You can see each other like here-ish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All angry and shit. Yerby. Entertain each other. Don't kill each other. Ray, what the fuck are you doing? Oh, damn it. Oh, my God. outside. Surprised we can't hear it today, actually. Whew. <laughs> oh, oh, and everything's on fire. Oh my god, everything's on fire. <sighs> Why don't I even say that? What? Maybe you can kind of hear it. Hmm. Curious. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Ah, she got me good. <laughs> like, run in front of me right as I'm, like, in this spooky-ass dungeon. Oh, that was, um... <laughs> mm -hmm. uh... <laughs> See, the longer we're here in our, like, little break, you know, where I could address you and talk to you, <laughs> the longer we could be here, the longer we don't have to deal with, um, <laughs> the basement, you know? Isn't that nice? <laughs> What's up? Welcome in, lively chat you have. No, no, they're deranged and putting everything on fire after I brought my cat back to the front of the house. And now they're, you know, creating the apocalypse eventually, essentially, right? And I'm wearing a little ponytail thing because I'm in a dark-ass fucking dungeon getting my ass eaten by the darkness. Also, so, so Anadil, what just happened, right? So my cat was sleeping on my bed, and I'm basically in VR, right? So, uh, it's fully immersive or whatever, and I have like one foot on the floor to try and ground me so I don't move around too much. And she just jumps down on the fucking floor and starts walking, and I feel like little vibrations and shit. Oh my god. Every game, VR game should come with a cat <laughs> for cover extra immersion. No. I love how you could give me the sharp back at the price of it, like, like 50,000, I can't abuse it. But he denies me. I deny you the power to shard Ophi. <laughs> um, God damn. Don't worry about it, indeed, don't worry about it. I'm just getting a little bit of, yeah, an IRL jump scare, basically, right? Stick around, stick around. You'll see why this next area is fucking spooky, by the way. It's spooky as shit. And then I'm, I'm in VR, so I'm like in that space, right? Here it's all, look, look, my room's all like lit. I have like a lamp there, I have a lamp there. I have, you know, lamps everywhere so you guys can see me in glorious HD. Um, meanwhile, the fucking world there is spooky and fucked. Hmm. <sighs> Damn. Cold ass, refrigerated Lipton iced tea. Swear to God. Tastes good. Not sponsored. 
That'd be funny if I was sponsored, but oh well. <sighs> Time to go back to hell! By the way, wait, was, was, um, was, like, my little, like, me sitting in the back. You, you guys could see me fairly well, right? Like, that wasn't too shitty. Like, it wasn't too cut off. Like, you could basically see my, my head, maybe not all my hand movements, but was I, like, it was perfectly legible? Okay, good, 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 good to know. I wish I had VR, but I know how sweaty the session is. <laughs> it's It's very much also a... Can you stomach it, right? Because sometimes I get a little bit of, like, the motion sickness, and I just stand still for a bit. And then, like, my body catches it up, and it's perfectly fine. I can keep going. It's, it's very weird like that, actually. I guess we can see you. Well, no, it's more like when I'm back here, right? It's, like, a little out of focus, so I have to do this. Okay, that's way worse. Now no one can see shit. There we go. Oh my god. Okay. So, let's, let's put this thing on again, right? Um, put the ponytail through. There we go. Okay. Both hands in. Controllers that are here that I can totally see. Um, aha, there we go. One looped in, the other looped in. There we go. One, there we go. Two, now we're both looped in. And now when I press this button, boop, we can head back into the game. And as from time to time, I can. Take a little peek underneath here to be able to see you guys. <laughs> Actually, probably sharper than before. Ooh, let's go. Hell yeah. Okay. Where was I? Oh yeah, fucking hell. Forgot. See, I gotta hold it like a like a regular third-person shooter. I'll run out. So we gotta show Anadil. Anadil is one of our mods. We have to show him. Anadil, look. So I'm la di da di da. Big titty vampires. I'm getting chased by women. And then look at this. And then I come into this room and look, it's all like, ah, look, it's all dudes or whatever the fuck. And then it's the darkness. And then you enter the darkness and it's all dark. By the way, the light shaking is my hand shaking. <laughs> I'm fucking tense here. <sighs> what? 60 bullets. Shoot you. <sighs> okay. Hello? Yo mama's a bit? Okay. Meow! The f is it like a dog collar? Not even. You're chased by a woman, yeah, very realistic lol. <laughs> Hurry, but we'll see chat with that thing on. I well, that's the, that's the funny part. I don't. 
So I have to just infer what chat is, or I have to do this little thing where I look, I, I peek behind the veil, look up, close my eyes, and kind of see you guys this way. That's the only way for me to quickly check what you guys are, are saying and stuff like that, you know? The only way for me to really see. Okay, so this room had nothing in it. That's a fucking problem. <laughs> Ditto. Nothing? Really? Got a shotgun, by the way. Fuck me that lore. Candidates, Irina, Mihaela, Luis, Ingrid's, Rejects. Those are a lot of names. <sighs> Those are bodies. I don't like that at all. Not one bit. Not one fucking bit. Attack! Oh, that's fucking great. Ah, yes. Ah, yes, the elephant head thing. Oh, that's oh, that's a nice chair. Ah, yes, it's the thumb screw. It's the thumb screw in your eye spring trap edition. Lovely. Love that. I love this place. I fucking love it here. It's amazing. Well, you guys keep hanging around. I'll see you deal with you guys later. Ah! What the fuck? You! That seems like a spooky room. Demon! Demon! I just wanna hang out with the not demons. Little room safety! Robust appetite. Robust appetite. Unstable. Overly alert at times. What the fuck? They weren't torturing people. They were experimenting on them. Not good to know. Spring trap horror, 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 horror. Solo level anime here, <laughs> anime please. Why does everything have to be FNAF reference? Well, I don't know if we could do VR horror right now, would have a heart attack. Uh, I believe you, Ophi. I believe you that you would have a heart attack indeed. It's just the tension's way higher. Ah! Fucking god! <sighs> Who? Who wants a piece of me? Come on! Now we're going to replace it with rage! Ah! Okay, retreat, retreat, retreat! We'll use 
Rage! Rage is our ally. We are a man. You do you do that hiss? I'll hiss. To growl! Growl back at them! They're coming from there, by the way. The sound is from there, but it seems to be like. I think it's like behind the corner? Alright, let's see what the butt map says. The butt map doesn't really tell us anything. Hate that. Hey! Hey! What? Retreat! 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 Whoa! Okay. New plan! <laughs> New plan! <laughs> Five bullets. <laughs> Three. Come here. Wait, 12? Oh, fuck me. The voices are... Okay! <laughs> oh my god, more? Sorry, I have to be quick. I have to scan the area, scan my surroundings, quickly capture things and move it to the fucking... There we go. One, two, three, fucking goddammit. Four. Five. Ooh, shit. Helps. Limit testing. Six. Seven. Ooh. Seven. Eight. Okay. Eight. Nine. Skills! 
fair. Skill issue. Skill issue. Come on! Come on, die! Woohoo! I did it! Bitch! Well, that went something. How many knives were that? I don't know. I think it was like fucking 20 or 30. <laughs> oh. Oh my god. We do not have a lot of bullets left. We lost a lot in that one. Yeah, I uh, was a bit overconfident there with the amount of bullets I thought they would take. Also, the like spawn holes, I don't trust. I don't trust. I don't trust. I don't trust that for shit because that means like infinite respawning enemies is a possibility, which I do not like. Oh, shit. Hey! Say hello to my booms! Got any back for you? Hello? Cassandra <laughs> caused all this mess. Whoa, 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 okay, 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 no, 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 Which tools do you prefer? I don't know. Stay away. Ah, oh, shit, 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 shit. <laughs> Boom! Ah! <laughs> get out! Ah! Oh! No! <sighs> get off! Okay. Run, 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 run. Bitch, 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 bitch. Where are you going, little one? Ah! Stay away! Oh. Ow. Okay. Ah! Bullets cannot harm. Oh! oh. Thing. Oh. I won't forgive you, you bastard! <laughs> yeah, what? Like this. Oh shit. Ow! Fuck you, god damn it! Oh, God damn, let out, 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 out. Ah! Don't believe it. Whoa! Crystal titties for me, I suppose. Oh, look at that. Wind. Ah, fresh air. You see? They were all stinky gamers, girls. They couldn't handle fresh air. Truly. Touching grass. The killer of all vampires. Oh, my God. 
You have a bat or anything this way? No, I have a little knife. And it does fuck all. Ooh, ten. Ten. Woohoo! I got some bullets. Now, maybe in my little crafting menu, can I make more shoddies? I need more. No, I need that. Yeah. There we go. There we go. I got more shoddy ammo as well. That's good. Shoddy ammo, handgun ammo. Good. Boom, baby. Okay, this place is kind of cool. God, they are. Look, it's like skin dogs. What the fuck? Bro. The Dimitrescians eat weird. Cassandra is kind of a hottie, though. Oh, fuck me. Custom parts, so customizable part for the handgun. Increasingly increases from gun power. Okay, do it. Oh yeah, look, there's like a little thing now. Look, it's a light tiny thing on the end. That's kind of cool. Ooh. Look, it's like on the that's kinda cool. Okay, so we got one of the daughters. Hell yeah. The bullet waste was crazy on the boss fight though, ain't gonna lie, Chief. <laughs> Look, in VR everything is more panicky, okay? It was mainly a waste because I didn't know that the recoil... Oh no, it's on the front it added it, okay. Like, the recoil was so big that like I should have compensated for it. But I kinda panicked, so you know, it was what it was. The shoddy ammo, that was perfectly fine though. Boom. Boom. Anything else? Oh. Actually, yes. What else here I miss? Double check. Might as well. Since there's no bitch now at the moment. Dead. Anything here? No, it was panic running. They gave me some shoddy ammo. No, okay. Let's get the fuck out of here. Sneaking around. Hello. Well, if they're bugs, do they just always know where I am? Or are they just kind of pulling in like that? No, that doesn't work. I need that for upstairs. Right? Oh, 
knives are very inaccurate. Like, forward, they're like, accurate as fuck, but when it's about up, they hate to be thrown up. Come on. Come on. Come on! You might just might say, but Tori, that was a waste of a bullet. And well, you are correct. <laughs> You're a hundred percent correct. However, uh, oh god, these bottles are big. Yo, big girl, need herself a big wine bottle. Suppose the lighting in this place is awesome. Even if it's just sort of the default lighting that the game comes with. Attention to details. Nice. It's like. Isolated and cold and dark. Awesome. Quite a while. <sighs> okay, I'll reach that in a bit. First, we need to find a safe place. Oh. Consistent patronage. I've expanded my services. Yeah! Big boy! Yeah! What do you got? I choose something for you. I don't know, man. What do you got? Do like... you have enough firepower? I can now offer an expanded weapon modification service. Yeah? It's the same shit. What did you change, my guy? At least tell me when you upgrade shit. Okay. All treasure. Oh my god! What did I get? Okay, crystal fragment, sure. Crystal skull. Oh, the torso. Ooh. Wooden angel statue. Valuable. Dimitrescu's daughter crystallized remains. Might as well give it to you, right? Ingrid's necklace. Necklace of animal bone used to ward against evil. I have no idea where I even found that one, but okay. Sure. Sell all treasure. Dissatisfied? I believe this is a fair price. I'm not bitching. You're bitching. Shut up. Whew. Learn how to make mines. That could actually be a funny one, though. Right? I haven't used them yet, but it might be smart to do. Sniper rifle ammo. That might also be a good one to use. Like, recipes are good, because they're always going to be in our advantage. Oh my god, look at how much lay we got. We got a lot of lay. I don't need extra baggage at the moment. Do any extra gunpower. Mm, that adds about 80. Damage to the shotgun. Ten. Seeking till next we meet. No, no, no. I need you. What are you, you buying? <laughs> Just something an old friend of mine used to say. <laughs> <laughs> well, cheeky Resi 4 reference. And then you. Because I might as well get that as well. Boom, baby. Thank you. our inventory then. Oh my god, look! We got a whole extra row. Awesome. Okay, we didn't we invested in the long term. That's what we now spend our money on. Hell yeah. Let me quickly take a look. Welcome in everybody. Hell yeah, look more people in the chat. Awesome. <laughs> nice. Whew. Okay, there we go. 
are you doing? Whatever. Okay, let's see what we are positioned in the room. Okay. Back into the horror. The horror that is this fucking place. Nope. But map. So we're here. We need to do these statue things. But first, we have to go... Dining room. We have to go up the mess hall. Up the hall. Wait a minute. We are here. We have to go here. To go up here to get whatever is there. Head back there. I need that lockpick from there, but I need to find a lockpick to be able to use it. So, yeah. We also haven't explored everything in this room. Apparently, which is interesting. Neither have we done there or there, which means there's something still in this room, which I think might be another thing to be lockpicked. Perhaps. Or something we missed, which we might as well. Go look for now. Hello? Now my idea is that either I missed something I can open up I don't think so. Or perhaps a similar aha. Did you look at that? Oh, yes. I think that's something we can sell, right? This is all an investment, even. Dimitrescu's blood red wine glass. Yeah, let's sell him that. And buy it, I will. Good day, then. He's massive. He's massive. Again, VR doesn't pop. Well, true D, what you guys see, what you guys can see, it doesn't properly convey how big this motherfucker is. He's huge! It's awesome. There, we sold Dimitrescu. We do, sold Dimitrescu's glass. We sold her her daughter. Remains. It's great. Into the into the merchant trade she goes. Okay. Kinda, you can't really see what's up there. Shut up! God, fucking merchant gotta be all spooky and shit. Dun dun dun. Bam! <laughs> okay. Oh, it shrank. Oh. Bye! Oh. Of course! Everything's a fucking secret room in this house. Mine. Why is everything a jump scare noise? Sorry, this is fun to do. <laughs> okay. We got the courtyard key. Now we can go to the courtyard. Oh, I can't have my thumb up, so it looks like I'm jerking off. Great. Lovely. Amazing. Do -do 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 -do. 
menu but okay god damn it oh shit oh this place is cool and big piece of like branch there that's not actually attached to anything that's kind of funny um ah that's where i thought oh interesting that's where i thought that one bitch okay cool good to know Gotcha. Intricate door. Okay, you need some kind of key. Oh. Look at that. Look at the little stone detail in the. That's actually pretty cool. Let me out! Let me out! There are women here. And there are some crazy bitches. Okay. Bro, Resi 4 is gonna be a weird game to play after this. Ah! He's done! system works where the moment you grab something it's immediately part of your inventory. Oh, shit. Look at all the little details. Look at the little leaves on the bottom of the thing also have textures. That's cool. You have an upside and a bottom side. 
there's like a difference between the two slightly, or it feels like there is. This thing is making a noise. Ooh. I hate it here. Okay, this soothes me, okay? There's something about this that's like kind of soothing to do. So I like doing it. across well on um, again what you guys see but it's like very yellowy it's very goldy and with the with the flames it goes all not disturb her. Silent here, I don't like that. Oh! This is pretty cool. I think she's mad, by the way, guys. I think she might be upset. Upsetty spaghetti. Women are blind to male advances, but the poor shall take their chance. Wait, eh. No, I can't read. To give. What? To give their lord their bounty sown, so that soon the wine may flow. Women are blind to male advances, but the poor shall take the chance. To give their lord their bounty sown, so soon the wine may flow. Cool, actually. The bowl. No, 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 no. They're gonna give it. No. Women are blind to male advances, but the poor shall take their chance. Come on. Come on. To give their lord their bounty sown, so that soon the wine may flow. Okay, you guys have to be simps for my lord. Yes. And my lord needs to be a simp for the women. That there. Boom, maybe. So that soon the wine may flow.
Nope. I'm taking a save. I'm not trusting any of this shit. It's really silent here. I don't like it. Run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. Do that? Oh my god! Okay, now that. That's pretty cool. Oh my god. I can open up more to the outside. Oh, that's interesting. Never knew that. Wait a minute. So if I open up every door, will that make it so cause I don't know which bitch it is. Run! 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 I can't open these windows. Damn it! Run! Can I open that one? No. Run! Yeah! There we go. Boom, baby. Hell yeah. Let me quickly. Make it so we can quickly. Whoa. Can drink a glass of iced tea. Let's go. Wait a minute. Let me just quickly change to the Zatsu screen so chats can be on chat on screen again. Hell yeah. I mean, Resi 5 is going to be weird. Resi 5 as well, but RE4 has a VR version, the remake. So, to play, when I play that after this, it's going to be weird. She wants that to came down, and I said no. <laughs> uh, not even the first boss yet. He's very much still in the beginning, and he's really the first heavy encounter. Well, I'll say this. Um, it's so cartoony when you broke the window. Yeah, the spinning of the shotgun, right? I'll say this, um, in VR, the sort of shorter pacing of this area is actually a lot more, okay, it's just gonna pause it, fine, okay, I'll pause them for a second, there you go, take that off so I can more perfectly address, no, I'll, I'll put it like this, it being in, in VR slows down everything maybe to like a snail's pace when it comes to progress, um, yet at the same time, it does make it more... Fun. That may be weird to describe. It's 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 everything's more methodical. I'm really taking my time, but I'm having a lot of fun doing so. So wait, I'm gonna set that here since there's a lot of stuff there anyway. I might as well open up this area of the frame a little bit, right? Okay, I'll be honest. I never knew that you could break the windows. <laughs> I never tried because you know why the fuck would I? Because I thought the, the loudness would probably activate her, but no. Um, God damn it! I don't want to go in the spooky basement. <sighs> I know we gotta go in the spooky basement. I just don't want to go in the spooky basement. <sighs> Dang it! Okay, spooky basement time. Let's go. At least the castle is kind of small enough to sort of navigate and run around in, which is kind of nice, actually, come to think of it. Uh, I know people wanted Demi Castle Dimitres to be a bigger part of the game, and I understand the logic, right? Because cause it would have been cool if it was bigger, but it isn't small. It could have been more interesting if it was bigger, probably. Maybe. You must do spooky basement. Spooky basement time. Hmm. <laughs> See, no. Spooky, I don't want to go in the basement. <laughs> but, but Van Helsing, I don't want to go to Transylvania. <laughs> but 
I'm in Helsing. I don't want to go into Transylvania. <laughs> Dang it. Uh, okay. Let's go. Van Helsing movie, 2003, I think. I don't know. You have to watch it if you haven't watched it yet. It's really, it's a really fun movie. I'm not gonna say it's good. It's not a cinematic masterpiece necessarily, but it's a really fun movie. And it has Hugh Jackman in it. It's pretty great. Really fun, really fun movie. Okay. Okay. Ah, uh, spooky basement time. Let's go. Let's put. Let me put on my hands. Which game do you ever say that sentence? Uh. I wonder why sometimes this doesn't like. Oh. I have a pipe bomb now? Well, oh, that's pretty cool. Would have been interesting if she was following me in here and I broke the glass to see what the reaction would have been. Oh, wow. Hey! Back to this place and it being dead fucking silent on the account of me. She's gonna be so angry when she notices I broke the glass. Fuck. Oh well. Okay, this area is like dead fucking silent. Which I don't like, especially after bitch over there took me to his shit. <sighs> Ooh. No, not that one. There we go. Titty aim! Eh, good enough. Sips! Oh, look at that. Ooh, boy, oh, look at the painting. Ooh, look at the shine on the painting. I can't see shit. Ooh. I know, quit stalling, go in the basement. <laughs> Look at that Van Helsing. I don't want to go to the. I don't want to go to the basement. Look at it. Look at me instantly regretting all the life choices I just made. Okay. Well, that's a shitty reflection. Let's go. Let's leave this place. Dang it! What the hell? Oh, that's freaky. Ah, uh, ha, ha, ha. I wonder if the reflection is better if you're... Oh. It looks like a, like a cube map, I think. Those are empty. Who is down here? Show yourself! Face me in armed combat! Face me! Combat of arms! You are an enemy. Oh, 
Okay. SHOW YOURSELF! WHERE ARE THEY? You coward, you face me, not combat. FACE ME! That this one. There we go. Hell yeah! Another. The combat is fun. I'll say that. My bloodlust is. Come here. Come here. Distillery. Okay. So where the fuck does that go? So that goes to there. And this goes So where? Oh, I can close thank you. Why can I close this? It makes me worried. Much rather be able to loop around, right? Whoa, 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 God damn it! Fuck! Okay, but what the fuck? <sighs> Maybe I could punch one in the face. That'd be pretty nice. Come on! Come on! <laughs> Boom, baby! Did you see that? See that? I punched the bitch in the face! Come here! Oh! Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, awesome. Okay, I can punch them in the face. That's actually kind of cool. Let's go! See, it's these tense sections that get me. It's like the cool action, and then it's all of a sudden... 
Hello. How are you? Why, thank you. Yeah. Ah! Oh, two, 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 three, three, three. Come on, come in. Eat shit! I'm so green. Good. Fuck yeah. You're still in big mode? Oh shit! I've been big mode this entire time. Oh fuck, I'm so sorry. Holy shit. Oh no. Oh no! The sound redeem so bad. Well, this is the thing. Even a sound redeem... Even with a sound redeem, I would have been able, wouldn't have been able to hear it. God damn it! Bro, that combat was awesome! Fuck! You all missed it! You missed my punch! Well, you kind of saw it, but like... Dang it! Ah, where's the next one? I need to take out my frustration on one. There we go. Come on! Where's the next one? Oh, that's me. Okay. Yeah, the reflection looks kind of bad, though, but oh well. Ah! Boom, baby! Yeah! Fist up the butt! Games to little sadness. Well, now it's better. To realization. I know. Uh, oh well. Where will this take me? village. Oh. oh look at the the dead people. Some weird trees like there. Some weird looking trees. Yeet! Thank God I noticed the screen thing before this next area. Oh. Boop. Boop. Well, that's a dead dog, wolf, bear. Claws. Whew. 
at the thing. There we go. You petted it for as much as that's possible and does something. Right I at regret to inform you that Ethan Winters has escaped that fool Heisenberg. Because he is in my castle and has already proven too much for my daughters to handle. When I find him... No, Mother Miranda. Yes, of course, I understand the importance yeah, of the I ceremony. I won't let you down. Ceremony. That man will pay for what he's done. That ass, though. Uh, something, something, thirst, something, something. He hey! Big booty bitch gonna kill me! Send help! I have a sneaky suspicion nobody's gonna send help, aren't they? <sighs> bork, bork, okay, you're all being horny, great. You're not helping me! You can't just be horny in chat! Well, you can, but like, how does that help me? Uh... Oh! called by Mother Miranda to decide the fate of the child's father. Just thinking of that family meeting makes me shudder. To think I'm treated like a sister to those miscreants. Especially Heisenberg. That riffraff would know proper manners if they slapped him in the face. I would have sliced him to ribbons if Mother hadn't stopped me. Why? Why does she treat me the same as them? She gave me this castle. Obedient daughters. Everlasting life, did she not? Am I not her favorite? Am I not special? I need a drink. Well, that I could attest to. Well, function alcoholic. <laughs> Actually, this is a good, like, height, size thing, right? Look at us. We come barely right up to her ass. Oh, she threw her lipstick on the floor. Huh. Well... The titty is about the size of my head! Whoa. And that's pretty big. Rose, where are you? We don't know. Now do we, Ethan? Ooh, shiny. There you go, music. Thank you. Now what? Does the booty say is in that room? Hmm. I have a bad feeling about this. 
Well, here goes nothing. Oh! Mary. Hi! All this for a child who is here. Sadness, right? What the hell? Do you... Ah! Ah! you ungrateful, selfish wretch. You come into my house. Ah! You lay your filthy man hands on what? my daughters. Her face and now you the... even try to steal my property. It's my power. Don't the worry. It's not about sexual things. Ah! You can, because I will hunt you, and I will break you. Let's go! Wait, that's not the way she meant it. Probably. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Worst. Yeah, fuck you, bitch. I got a gun that doesn't work. Bro, her head's like her titty is maybe the size of my head, but her head's the size of my ass. Wait, no, like bigger. Just. Don't worry about it. God damn it. Oh, wait. Move, Ethan, it's my turn. No. God damn it. Step on me, oh my god. You're all just irony for her, no. Uh. <sighs> the music's being very, uh... Thank you. Oh, n oh my god. We have... P.B. Elephant, we have this thing, we have that thing, but can we go in? Oh, we can't go in. We can kind of go in it. Yeah. Oh my god, and actually you can see like the, the little spring trap thingies. Oh my god. Well, it's, no, that's impossible. Orientate myself, okay. The sneaking suspicion. Aha! The exit. Oh. Well, it's like supplies. I was supposed to not see that. You'll be sliced to ribbons. Get through the wall. Oh shit! Shit! You shit! Will. Trask. No! Ah! No! Oh. 
My hand, 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 my hand. I need, I need it back. Yes, please. Let's wrap things up. My hand, my hand, my hand, my hand. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Turkey item. Yes. Can I? Can I? Can I? I need. I need that. Get, give me that. Okay, let me put the. Eh. Come on, put the hand back. I know my right hand's unusable! How do I deal it? Win, right? Yes. Uh oh. Ah! You hack! Don't you absolute hack! Ha ha! Got you, bitch! Hey, hey, uh, 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 uh. Come on, a uh, door open. <laughs> Running will get you nowhere. Well. On. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Good, good. Maybe not put it on sideways, Ethan. Maybe, you know, put it on good, like, 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 like good. Shit. Haha, <laughs> that's so cool. Let's root this castle. Aim into that. Come here, come here, come here, come here, bitch! Gotcha! Uh, where do we go now? Um, back to the main house, I suppose? Spawn. Okay, fuck this. Out of here. It's all sideways on.
You. Oh. That's pretty cool. Boop! <laughs> it's a pleasure to see you safe. How were things? Pretty ass! I'm so sorry it turned out that way. Well, you'll find your way to her once you're out of this castle. Do you have need of anything for the road ahead? Welcome, welcome. You're sure to find something new. Will I? Welcome. Show me. I'm skilled at all sorts of weapons modifications, and will do them for a small fee. Greatly increases ammo capacity. Interesting. Crystal skull. Little and often fills the purse, as they say. Oh. I didn't even realize I had stuff. Okay. Have a wonderful adventure. I will. <sighs> Quickly take this off for a few seconds. Recover and get a drink. A little bit of sippies. Said it keeps going into like the pause menu every time you take off the headset. I wish you wouldn't do that. It's perfect for real way. I actually want to catch up on some, on chat for a second. <laughs> oh my god. Their titties are the size of my head and their heads the size of my hands of a bigger Tory 2024. God damn it. No, Ethan, it's my turn. No. <laughs> Ooga. Oh my god, you're all just fucking horny. Oh, that's funny. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna just get, get like a little sippy in here. Oh no. How long have we been going? We've been going for three hours now, damn. I don't know if I'm going to complete the entire of the castle, though. Take a little sip first. Let's then see if I can, uh... And do it. I said what I said, and I stand by that, Auga. You know what? I, um, I, 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 uh, what's it called? I can respect it. Enable it, not enabling the horny, but accepting the horny. Accepting the horny for the Dimitrescu. I, I can, I can respect the honorable way of at least owning it. I'm not trying to hide it. <laughs> oh, God. Bro, but like, in, like actually, her, her, so yeah, like her titty is like this, which means both titties are like this, right? Which, which, and then she's also like yay high. So even though I'm sitting, like imagine I'm standing up, right? I don't want to adjust the camera. Like it's it's like here the titties, but then her head is like, is like this, no. I don't know, it's, it's, maybe her head is smaller, but like her head is huge. It's only now that I actually notice how much bigger her head is than I thought, which is interesting. I have no shame in simping if I simp for such a work of art like Lady Dimmy. Yes, chat, if you simp for Lady Dimmy, then you are just a regular person. She's got a bigger brain than us. Oh no, oh no. Dummy Tresk. Uh, Titty Tresk is queen. Uh, the, the, okay, 
But the memes are so overdone. Oh, it's so, it's so, how many times have you already heard the meme where it's like, oh, she's the mommy that, like, fucks us all up. Oh, it's so tragic. It's so unoriginal. I don't care. I do not care. It's unoriginal, but it's, but it is what it is, you know? Um, trying to think. Are we about halfway through the castle? Right? Like, now... I'm trying to think what we do now. Now maybe we go back. Well, we have that key. We have key with which we can open many things. Um, now we take the key. And we head to somewhere or another. Because we still need to find the three masks. Right? And that's kind of, Yeah, that's the part we're now at. We, we're, we now can start unlocking doors in the mansion. And getting the, the three, three like, head things to kill Domitresk. Um, I don't think I'm going to do Dimitrescu in one part. Wait. Ophi! Ophi! You have recently played the game, right? Relatively recently. Um, is this a decent stopping point, maybe? Uh, or is there, like, a little bit more we should play and then uh, stop for today? I want to be, like, halfway in the castle is, like, kind of where I want to stop. Um, think play a little more? Oh, okay, okay. Oh, wait, yeah, well, yeah, because, like, okay, no, then stop, then then probably today, then we can just round off, we can just make it a little bit of just chatting, you know, instead of continuing the, the, the game, not that I necessarily don't want to, but also just for my own, okay, this is the thing, right, with VR, it's better to stop when you think it's a good moment to stop, than to just continue playing until you get nauseous, because if you keep pushing it until you get nauseous, what will happen, right, is that um, if you are, your body will hate the sickness um, motion and, and like, 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 again, it, it thinks you're basically being poisoned, right? Um, so what it'll do is it'll, it'll, it'll associate VR with poison. And so subconsciously, even if you want to play VR, your body will kind of stop you from wanting to play VR. And so you'll be like, no, no, I don't want to play VR. Why? Not because you're not in the mood for VR, but because your body thinks it's poison. So, you know. In that sense, it's maybe a good idea. I just kind of call it there. Um, and, and, me, and, and because now we can, for a little while, at least for this week, we could return to daily stream. So for, 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 although I think tomorrow, yeah, we're going to be playing RE5 with, 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 with oh, or is it the day after? I don't remember which one day. One of these days. Um, so we are going to take a little break of this uh might just earlier on tomorrow perhaps play it or wait it's it's only 10 30 here holy shit it's actually relatively early for for usually when i stream it's kind of funny um just get the just get my hair a little bit get my hair a little bit fluffy get a little bit everywhere you know so it's a little bit of a if you want to do if you want to have a little more of the castle, it's best to stop now. There's still some time in there, but now it's pretty good time game-wise. Okay, no, that's fair. You're close to the boss, but quite a bit more work to do, so good time to stop. Well, I know Dimitres gets done after you do the three masks, but for the three masks, you still have two daughters I have to kill. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. I'm surprised we went for three hours. Actually, it, it's, it was around the two-hour mark when I was first starting to feel the... Mm, Random, but why does Tori look like Jesus with this hair? <laughs> I am. I. God damn it. Ah yes, I went from the demon prince to the. You see, I'm the Antichrist. There we go. I'm 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 son of Antichrist. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> demon blasphemer. How dare thee? How dare thee blaspheme against the demon kind? That is the the demon of demon. Yes. Uh There we go. Just did the stream title and everything to like like ah yes, there we go. We're gonna be a just chatting stream from now on for a little bit as I um think about what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna first of all just turn off the, the thing so I can put on my headset maybe later on as well. Uh, let me see, right? So we saved. Yeah, we saved. 
a good save. So then we can quit game. Let me just quickly go back in so I can double check that I save before I accidentally don't save and then like lose prog. Press. Ah. Okay, that's one hand. There we go. That's the second hand. Uh. Come on. There we go. It's fun. Holy shit, this, this game. It's a bit... Not... Again, it's not like, oh, I haven't had fun in VR, but there's also... Okay, no. There, okay, so let me let me maybe start describing what I do think the PSVR does, like, way better um, than the HTC Vive Generation one, right? Look, look, what does it do better than, like, a... How old is that other headset? Like, like a... Like a, like a really ancient headset from 2016. The weight? distribution once you sort of get it down it's a little uncomfortable in the forehead sometimes but like it is it is a way better like manageable weight on the thing then um yeah like and, and the little like the floppy side stuff that like closes off the light leak is also very um very good actually really enhances the experience let me just put these whoop, put these away is it 600 bucks worth of, of good? No. But again, getting it on the cheap second hand, if you can, negotiate the price down. Eh, if you have a PS5, you might as well get it because it's like, <laughs> it, it really enhances the, 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 the experience, I'd say. Wait, let me, let me, not Twitch chat simping, no. Keyboard ASMR. Ah, yes. <laughs> Jesus Pillar, the Antichrist Demon Prince, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> yes, that is that is the evolution. We went from... We went from Bark and Bin Copy Markiplier to... Ah, yes. Jesus is on the screen now. <laughs> I could start a religion. The religion needs big booty bitches. No, that's not what the religion needs. Or does it? <laughs> Reminds me of that meme with the, like, I don't know where it's from. But it's like some kind of demon thing. It's like, I do not like hunky boys. And then it's like a little, the argument with a little girl. Hmm, unless. Or like, I don't know what it is. Like, like uh, maybe. But in this case, it's like, no, not big titties. Hmm, unless. <laughs> This is Pillar the Antichrist Demon Prince Man. Oh my god. Yes, that is the Tory new name. Shouldn't have called the channel Tory Tangents. This have called Tory the Antichrist. Tory Antichrist. Tor Anti. Tor Christ. Wait. Where the fuck is my. Oh god, it was under my chair. My, my, my. I just. Continue drinking that. Ah. Big booty bitches religion. Count me to fucking. <laughs> yes! We grow stronger every day as we create this new heretical religion. Many people will call us heretics. Many people will call us insane. But they just don't accept the words that I know will be the true, true words of meaning in life. Will be something, something, big booty bitches. I'm going to put Twitch chat. I'm going to put YouTube chat there. I'm going to put Twitch chat there and then it'll be like i'm talking at least into the microphone so you see that's smart right look at that Ooh, big brain big brain streamer does a big brain thing where he thinks about what he's doing instead of just talking like a complete idiot the entire time wait and then since i'm closer there we go there we go and now i'm now i'm um in focus. Look at that. Isn't that nice? And you have mean focus. You have the voice thing. You have this backlight. You have the front light. We have the we have, we have the camera. We could turn on another light if we want to. We have multiple lights. More lights. All lights. Only lights. Um, no dark. 
Why would I make this place dark? That'd be spooky. When this is not a spooky channel, this is a big boy channel. Big stream. Lots of things. Hell yeah. Isn't that religion just straight men? <laughs> no, because they hate them. <laughs> <Du -dum -tch. laughs> or lesbians. Eh. Fair enough. All the lights. All the lights, Mothman noises. What are the Mothman's noises, actually, come to think of it? Like, what does the Mothman have for noises that, that he makes? Is he just like... I don't know. What is it? Does the Mothman make noises? I think the Mothman just shits on the floor, right? Just... Like, like that's Because it's a moth. And, and they, like, spin silk. So, like, it's like they're shitting. I don't know. I don't know where I was going with this, okay? I had a thread, and it was going somewhere. And then, then go anywhere. <laughs> no, no. Well, I'll say this, right? I very much like this kind of cool little trick you could do when you're shooting the gun, right? Is in, unless un, instead of shooting the gun until it's all the way empty, what you do is you shoot it until there's like one bullet left in the chamber, and if you can help it, you can like eject the uh, inject the cartridge because you don't lose any bullets that are left in the cartridge, right? It's not like hell divers, um, your or real life. Uh, and you then you then just inject a new um, cartridge, but because there's still one in the chamber, you can just continue shooting continuously without needing to, like, cock the gun back, you know? Uh, which you have to do if you, you fuck up all the way. Same thing with the shotgun. If you just, before you have to fully, before you're, because you have to, like, cock the thing every time in between, right? If you can just reload it with, like, your, your fingers and stuff like that. It's fun. It, it's really fun to do. Um, and if anything, if you have the PSVR, even though you might be like, hey, I just want to play, play Resident Evil 4, you know? This might be a good one just to play to get into the combat, because Resident Evil 4 is much more intense of its combat, right? This game is a lot more subdued, and therefore introduces you in, brings you into it way slower. But, because of that, it actually is, 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 a, is a... It's scarier... But it is, so far, much more nicer, I'd say, to get into when it comes to the VR, right? Castle Domitresque, especially, is, is pretty good when it comes to um, getting you into the VR space and into the pacing with the combat in this game. Whilst in, in, in counteraction, like, 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 like Resident Evil 4 is just fucking action the entire time at a high level, right? Wait, 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 wait. Mothman noises has a statement that straight men hate women is very much true, not gonna lie. Whatever noise you can imagine, I haven't thought about that though yet. Big smart, actually. <laughs> it should be like wind flapping, wind flap, wind flap, with a slight buzz in the background. <laughs> Maybe some like cryptic melody in the background just for the giggles. I don't know, what's the Mothman? Well, although that would not be that threatening, right? You're, although, no, actually, it would probably scare the shit out of you. Imagine you're in the dark. It's the middle of the night. You're walking through the woods, and all of a sudden, you hear... <laughs> like that fucking... That scared the fucking shit out of you all of a sudden if it's loud enough, right? Like, like, <laughs> it's like what the fuck is that? This is the moth... I'm the moth man! I have moth... <laughs> Jesus Christ! Get attacked by the Mothman. Head pads, head pads. <laughs> ah, yes. With the horror, 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 horror music in the background. No, no, Fnaf, get out! My mom! <laughs> you don't know if Fnaf does to her mother, it hurts me. <laughs> horror, 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 horror. Is the Freddy Fazbear? <laughs> Tori went Mothman mode. Yes. It's when it's when it's when Mothman's going. <laughs> the Mothman. The Mothman is like, oh, which fucking movie monster was it again? Which movie monster was it again that knows your your deepest fears? And like uses them against you? Was it the Boogeyman? No. The Boogeyman. Which movie was that again? Not the Bye Bye Man, 
Not Nightmare on Elm Street. The 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 Babadook. Though did he use your fears against you? I don't remember. Which demon was it again? Which demon like he like oh he knows your fears and uses them against you? Kind of shit. Which one was that again? I don't remember. <laughs> Moth Tori. No. Do I get more head pets if I never mention FNAF asking for a friend? Uh, no, 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 no. That's on her stream. That if you don't, if you don't mention FNAF there, you get head pets. Here, you get rewarded and you get called a good boy or a good girl <laughs> when you torment her. <laughs> Cause it's funny to me. <laughs> you see, this is how that. This is how the. This is how the working relation works. She mods for me, and I mention. <laughs> No. Actually, we were doing a good job of not mentioning FNAF. I'm gonna be perfectly honest. No make FNAF into my stream. You see, there she goes. See, she she she, she wants the FNAF. She's she's excited for it. <laughs> she salivates at the thought of Five Freddy Five. Can't fucking do it. Salivates at the thought of Freddy Five Bear entering her stream. Har, har. <laughs> so stupid. Um, uh, the worst part is it's a fucking VR game, and it's like, oh, you play Help on it too. It's the good one. Like, no, no, I don't need Steel Wolves, whatever. Plus, like, like VR is fun. You know, VR horror is fun in in in, in, in FNAF in, in in Resident Evil Eight. Cause I can fight back. I can shoot back. Animatronics, you can't do shit. It's like, ah, I'm scared. You die. Hate that shit. I'm crying now. Congrats, all you made mom cry. Oh no. <laughs> oh dear. Now I gotta make sure to play my cards right. Good boy, your head pad. It's hard. You can call it a good boy. Yeah. Think about that. You could be called that. You could be called a good boy, good girl. You could be called many things. Or, or you might get imaginary head pads that you don't even really get. Think about that. Hmm. <laughs> Ah yes, mom's chat. Oh my god. <laughs> I brought a friend home for you. His name is Freddy. No, not Freddy Five Bear. And then he put him in the Freddy Five Bear. And he he is the Bonnie the Icken and then the animatronic and then Freddy Five Bear and he's the I can't even speak. <laughs> oh shit. No oh, shit, stream elements. Oh no! Oh no, I'm gonna have to adjust stream elements because that link doesn't work anymore now, does it? Yeah, oh no, it does. Wait, it does? Huh. That's kind of curious. Why does that... Why does that link still work? Actually, I'm actually surprised. Holy shit. Wait, so me going into... Yeah. Ooh, oh, streamception. No, it it's me in my Wait, stream. Wait, so if I go back to my channel... No, that's Tori Tangents. But it's still Tori VTuber? So they both work. Oh! That's kind of cool. Didn't expect it, but like, that's kind of cool. Ooh, it's freaky. Some freaky shit. So much teasing. Poor, poor mother, no. Sorry, I keep thinking of like an Andrew Schultz bit. bit. I don't know where it's from anymore, but it's just at some point, it's, Daddy's home! And I don't, uh, the, that's the, 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 the line that gets in my head, but I just don't know what the fuck that has to do with anything. I can't link that. I can't link that to a bit. It's just a line that's that's in my head for, for God knows what reason. Um, it's just funny to say stupid shit, I suppose. <laughs> oh, God. Comfort. Oh, the, there is no hug command. There is no patting command. There's no patting command. It's only sadness in this entire stream. <laughs> oh, God. Ah, uh, That was good. I haven't even installed Resi 5 yet on my Steam. I probably would have, should have to do that in a bit. Oh, there's little vents on the top. There's a little vents in the thing here, if you could see that. Look at that. Ooh. Actually, I'll say that. This thing doesn't seem to fog up at all for me. And, like, when it comes to the heat, 
it's the pressure on the forehead, right? With the plastic, that's maybe the only sort of kind of annoying thing. Um, when it comes to, like, the, the device itself, it really doesn't, like, heat up my eyes like the Vive does. Because one thing the Vive does, the Vive kind of sits on my head and it, like, warms up my face, essentially. Um, not too bad, but in comparison, the, the, the PS5 one just doesn't actually... Yeah, it's, it's, it's this weird sort of, like... It, the where the place it sits at on your forehead is like right on that hairline, which is a little awkward. I'm trying to think, what could you do to make it less? Hmm. Yeah, we just had like a extra band you could like, so it could like have a third axis of of of. of of weight distribution that might be the best hmm I have to test that see if I can get that maybe in there the material is kind of nice it's this weird like plasticky but it has like the little PS PlayStation logo sort of like how it has on the back of the controllers sort of like that it's it's interesting Ooh. I feel there's like, oh, it's like weird, like little popping things in there. What the fuck? Cool. It's like I'm playing with rubber foam. Interesting. Sorry. Sorry, I got distracted there. Um, put that down. If you take the Freddy Five Bear pizza, I'll run away screaming. We're sad this doesn't exist, probably. Or. But I promise you, would place its location at some point. We don't talk about it. <laughs> but on topic, comments that headset does look decently comfy. It is. It it is comfy. Um, although I am curious if I can find an accessory or two online to make the how to put it the wearing of this thing slightly more comfortable. Again, I think like just a third strap here to to just like have an extra center of how to put it of just weight distribution. So it's not all. Essentially, either um, pressing on the forehead here, or or like 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 pull tugging on the backside there. If we could just have this third axis of of of, of essentially rest, that would be pretty decent. I am honestly surprised with VR headsets, by the way. Like I know everyone wants the idea of ah yes glasses and you can get in VR, but since all headsets have essentially the issue of like weight distribution on heads i am i okay this is my, my point right i am incredibly surprised that with the issues that all headsets even the psvr to an extent has um when it comes to weight distribution on heads and stuff like that i'm surprised none of them have at least attempted a helmet design okay it might get a be it might start sounding a little bit sword art online -y in a bad way maybe right but think about it a more helmet type design with maybe like a little bit of an open part in in the back as well a little bit so it like there's a little bit more room to breathe would allow for i don't know maybe some decent like headset type thing like over ear headset type um support you could put in there um let's say it's a standalone headset if you can have like a helmet that's like a standalone headset perhaps that could also have more camera trackers around the entire device to help you navigate it could have a heavier battery pack in the back so you know you have like a head distribution thing going you, you have more room to perhaps on the top put the, the put the devices like uh distribute like the, the the mechanisms of the device so so more of the tech is spread out throughout the head and stuff like that instead of it all being centered in this like view front view clunky screen thing so it wouldn't be so front heavy so you can make, maybe make the distribution more top heavy right and, or am i just stupid for thinking that not the Apple Vision Pro, no. That set looks more like, comfortable than the Apple's 3.5K. Hey, hey, this thing cost me like 300 bucks, but at least with this thing, I have games to play with it. The Apple Vision Pro, dog shit, nothing. It doesn't have anything. It has, it just, it's just a dystopian nightmare. <laughs> that thing gave Tori trauma just from watching the spec video. The teasing video for the Apple Vision Pro got taken down on my goddamn channel. I made a little video about it when that happened. <laughs> the more support in the padding makes it comfy. Ah, fair enough. Oh, well, forgot, I forgot about the Tori's Apple Vision Pro tangent. Nobody has to forget about the Apple Vision Pro tangent. 
just Har har. There we go. Oh damn, Tori is cooking. <laughs> no, but he has a point. A helmet would be cool for better noise cancellation and to block out the outside world. Right? And just weight distribution wise. Oh damn, Tori is cooking. What if the screen flips up and down like a helmet glass part? No, that would be too... That would be maybe too much. Again, just a helmet thing. And then make, like, sort of segmented so you can have, like, little knobs to adjust, like, the height of the side pieces, the front pieces and stuff like that. So you can sort of, I don't know, like, like customly adjust the... How all the the, the parts are, are sort of, like, um, distributed on your head, right? But it would make it so that, like, you can have the battery pack on the back, you know, so it... it, it, it pulls back a tiny bit and you can have the the vr like how to put it like the um, you can have like the processor and stuff like that just on top maybe like have a docking station in the back so you can like connect to your pc through it or whatever i don't know that makes sense to me You can see it on YouTube. Yeah, in the edited um, content playlist. And or if you go into videos, you have to scroll down a little bit, probably. I don't know where it is. But yeah, no, 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 no. I feel like a, like VR could just be improved with a headset that looks like a helmet. Stop with the whole... Because everyone's just chasing this design, right? Essentially, where it's like the, the front Oculus Rift sort of like, ah, look, it's a screen within a thing. But, like, why do that? You can have more of these cameras, the IR cameras, the inner, inner out trackers, if you could have them all around your head. Now, it would probably make the device significantly more expensive, just for the reason of, like, having to have more, I guess, plastic on the thing. But, like, it would solve so many issues. It would, it would, it would basically negate the whole problem with like ah yes but inside out tracking is like less good which it is not that i've noticed it that much the the controllers are slightly less accurate than the valve index with the base stations i'll say that but it's not that bad Especially also because the way I'm seated right the way i'm seated makes it so i'm constantly basically playing to the front of me so i'm like playing forward essentially right and so, that makes it doable, very much. I feel like if the helmet concept was real, there would have been a horror movies where they will merge the helmet to some guy's head. Well, they kind of did that. It was an anime in 2012 called Sword Art Online. It was, it's very bad. It's a bad show, you shouldn't watch it. But, like, that concept pretty much captivated audiences back in 2012 with, with that first season of that show, right? It's also... Unironically, kind of the show that put Crunchyroll on the map, which is funny to think about, but like, I swear to God, before there was Attack on Titan, there was Sword Art Online. And it sucks. The shows, there's a reason not many anime fans tend to talk about it. Um, outside of in like a cosplay setting, there's some interesting designs here and there with it, but like, for the majority of that show, run and, and the notoriety online it's it's basically known as hey this thing kind of really sucks um and that's it no <laughs> better did i keep cooking elon musk might actually make it real oh my god ah oh, yes the musk helmet <laughs> the musk helmet comes with a free like you, you put it on and the only free thing about it is that when you put it on there's like a scent of like a, a stench there's like a stench in it that you can't get rid of <laughs> SAO is like yeah it's one of its kind yeah yeah it's it's one of those it was it's, I don't know ironically it was kind of one of the first of those like isekai -ish type shows where it's a show about, oh, regular people in a fantasy setting. Later on throughout the 2010s, it actually became the whole transported to another world thing. But for Sword Art Online, it was the, oh, now, what if the, if you die in the video game, you die in real life. Ooh, sort of thing. That, that's what that had going on. Um, 
a very underwhelming show. But to its credit, it doesn't have good action at choreography. But to its credit, it has some pretty damn good music. Which basically carried the entire show. Yeah. Oh, well, a lot of good music. It has like one battle theme that's really fucking good. Um, that carried it throughout the entire time of its runs. Basically just like My Hero Academia. You know, one really good action, one, not even a good action scene, one really good theme that basically just carries the popularity of the fucking thing. No, but I like Deku as a relatable character and that showed him totally right in his normal way. Nobody cared. Nobody cared. That theme song that they used throughout the anime. You say Run carried that fucking show. I'ma say it. No, I haven't watched it since, <laughs> since a while. <laughs> I read the manga. Deku has like an edgy arc for like three episodes, for like three days or whatever. It's silly as fuck. Uh, facts, the OST is great. Right, like like the soundtrack is really good. The soundtrack carried it. But then again, I'm the weird nutcase that thinks ma mainly a lot of anime is just carried by their soundtracks. Because, oh, but no, it's carried for the animation. It's like, yeah, but no. Some of the choreography, sure, and, and, but, like, I still don't really think there's an anime that has topped the animation quality, consistent, relatively consistent animation quality that, like, 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 One Punch Man showed throughout it, well, season one, throughout its, like, limited run, but then again, I'm not that big into Shonen, so I don't keep up with, like, ah, this is the latest Shonen show, or, or Jujutsu Kaisen, you know? that Again, that's, like, one that just flew me by. I didn't see any of that. Uh, but Konosuba Season 3 is airing right now, which, fuck yeah! Tori gets what he wants! More Konosuba and shit! And then there's a bunch of other shows airing that I should probably check out. There's one about, like, Magical Girls that aired last season. Um, like this, this like the word is like girl that that looks up to magical girls becomes like a magical girl that punishes other magical girls like a villain character. It's kind of an interesting premise. It's probably one if it, it's probably one of those comedy shows. Slash, I can't believe this is an anti shows. Huh. Uh, but those are fun, you know. Those tend to, those tend to be more funny. Um, if you know you're an idiot like me and have been watching anime for over ten years, that tends to help. Uh, not normalize it. Just you know, you don't. You... There's this fun thing where every few years, like the discussion around weird anime becomes like, oh, weird anime. Do we need it? And it, and uh, to be honest, the conclusion is just this: it's like. This discussion has been going on for over 10 years. The conclusion is, hey, if you feel uncomfortable with an anime, stop watching it. But other than that, eh, if it's me, just, just watch it or whatever. You don't tend to, you're not able to really exercise any influence on the way they're made or whatever. And is there an exploitative nature to it? Yeah, but that's the entire anime industry. Isn't that right? Boom. Do -do. Or something like that. If that makes sense. Um, true XD. It, you know, that's it's it's. Okay, cause so many people want to overcomplicate it. So it's just that's the it's that easy. Two sentences, boom. Yeah. Uh, there you go. All of all of difficult anime solved in, in two three sentences. Now, I'm gonna quickly go to the bathroom for a second. So you guys rest here. I'm thinking it's going to be absolute silence if I mute my microphone, so you guys will have to deal with that. I'm going to quickly go away.
What in the absolute ass? <sighs> ah, yes. Everything is... Don't worry, say this from the P muses. We will hear you pee if you don't mute. Oh, my life. But I muted, didn't I? I think I did. I think I muted. God, you're already putting the entire thing on fire. How could you? You did mute. There you go. I did mute. Why are people complaining about it? Dang it. Ha ha ha. Let me. In the meantime, by the way, look for someone to raid. If you guys will indulge me in it. So I can send you all on your merry way into different areas as we perhaps brainstorm for a final topic to think about. As we, as we, as we exist in this place. Oh damn, there's a lot of people alive. What the fuck? That's different from normal, normally when I like try to end, like when I'm running off streams or whatever. It tends to be when like everyone's already going offline or whatever. Uh, so that's kind of funny to now be in sort of the middle of just people actually being live. That's it's, it's kind of cool. Didn't expect that that much, but you know, oh well. Um... Wait, what the fuck? Interesting. Hmm. Yeah, I'll probably send you guys there on YouTube. That's probably the best bet that I have. Um. Ooh, no, 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 no. Click on scene things. Dang it. <laughs> it hit mute. Let's see. Who is all live on the Twitch TV of Twitch? No, show more. Twitch has such an annoying interface when it comes to actually looking at who's online and, and not and stuff like that. I swear to God, it, it is actually really annoying. I can't believe it. Um, you'd think it'd be easier to do, but nope, nope. For some reason, it's actually very, how to put it, unhinged? No. Annoying? Yes. But how? I don't remember. Ah. <sighs> True, Twitch just have that annoying quirk. Yeah, I, I wish that... Tw I, I really... I do actually really wish that, like, Twitch... Um, how to put it? That I, I wish Twitch... That, 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 that Twitch rating just worked exactly how... Um, how it works for... For... For, for YouTube, because honestly, that system is so much better. See if it works. Yeah, okay, there. We're gonna send you guys off to to Joel, porcelain maid, who is just starting off stream. So we'll be early. Um, I have no idea what they're gonna do. I see just chatting. So Monster girl art lore with Mim Kai. That's actually a good. That actually sounds kind of fun to look at. I can't hear anything. Why can't I hear anything? Oh, because I muted my fucking PC. Big brain, big brain, you know, mute stuff so I can't hear anything. <sighs> anyway, so on the Twitch side of things, I want to thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's stream. Be sure to follow to stay tuned for next time. Don't forget to join the Discord so you'll be notified whenever I go live. Um, we might be taking a break for a little bit as we're going to be indulging Ovi on her birthday to play playing with playing Resident Evil 5. But after that, we will definitely be back and or in between. We'll see how we fill it up. Uh, we will be back with more Resi 8 VR Big Diddy Edition. We have to complete it. We have to... We have to face Domitresk. And because now I realize that it isn't Dimitresk. Castle Dimitresk is Domitresk. Even though it's an I in the word. But I guess they pronounce it differently. But they still all talk American English for some reason. I still don't really get that. It's, no, it's a pet peeve. Where's my broken... Welcome to the Castle Domitresk. Which might be more bleh. Like, like, like stereotypical. But it's Resident fucking evil. You know, everyone's like a stereotypical villain. Would have been cute. Anyway. With that said, take care. I talked for too long. Whoopsie. <laughs> yeah, we just, uh, oh, they shot it out. Cute.
No. Um, yeah, I'm going to click the end and stream button there. Um, we... How to put it? Yeah, when I just talked over my fucking outro. I forgot that I was I was rating out. Whoopsie! It happens. Um, yeah, no, so where was I? Don't forget to like the stream if you like the stream. Subscribe. See you guys next time. And I will be there for more big titty fun. I mean, more VR fun. God damn it. Uh, take care, everybody. See you in the next one. Goodbye. That's that. That's it. But look at look at look at the logo. Look at that. <laughs> what if I make the next thumbnail just this thumbnail, but like just zoom in way more on on Dimmy Chesk's ass or titties? <laughs> oh, that'd be a little bit funny. Oh well. Take care, everybody.